Real Housewives of Potomac in 60 seconds. For however long it takes me. Darker hair for fall. You like it? All right. So the MVP of this episode is production. They were reasonably shady. <laughs> Let's play a little game. You let me know if it's reasonable or shady. Production, keeping in the clip of when the Grand Dame came to visit Wendy's home and Wendy goes up into the cabinet and gets some sugar packets from a big old bag of stolen sugar from Dunkin' Donuts. Reasonable or shady? I'll wait. To DeGel is talking under her breath about poor Candace's video shoot and calling it low budget and production deciding to pan a scene of the exterior of her home. Reasonable or shady? <laughs> I don't care what you do in any other franchise. Cast whoever you want to cast. But you're going to need to hire the production team that does Real Housewives of Potomac. Because they are everything. They're giving what it needs to give. A few of my favorite reads. And quite honestly, Wendy was on fire to me this episode. Giselle. I mean, you a hater, so... Wendy. What am I hating over? This? I'm hating over this? I mean, I don't make fun of other people's dwellings, but if anybody deserves the shade, it's jail. Come through a scholar when you visited Canada, a.k.a. Wendy's home. <laughs> and when you got Mia all the way together and told her to show her ass all the way up and have several of the seats. Because <laughs> you can say whatever you want to say. Don't try it with your hoe ass. <laughs> Giselle, you can call this company called mosquito joes and it's like humane and environmentally sound and it will get rid of the gnats in your yard the winner of the shadiest moment of the episode is the queen herself grand dame la dame for taking over the whole event and turning it into a commercial for her business yes business 101 yes marketing if we're gonna do this do this thing bring all them girls some of your fragrance prototypes for free packaged lovely so you could do a commercial of your three wick not one not two but three wicks <laughs> bohemian rhapsody or whatever it's called <laughs> place my real talk about to place my order just for the finesse of it i was appreciating that business acumen pimp it miss karen and i'm with you miss karen you know got yourself vaccinated or vaccinated to be around these heifers and they added a fool <laughs> and you know brought them some of your prototypes you can have a commercial and they ungrateful I'm tired of the reads on people's parents. You know, that person on that show I was on for five minutes, always talking about somebody's damn mama. Get a more educated read. Finn.